Does a woman need a man? I don't in think, life. I don't think no? it's necessary. You don't think we're necessary? And so do you prefer Taiwanese men or do you prefer foreign men? Uh -huh. Who do you think is cuter? Three, two, one. With much of the Western world captured by modern day feminism, we are seeing many, many men feeling disenfranchised with our modern dating culture. A growing number of which looking elsewhere in the hopes that foreign lands may provide more options in terms of women with truly traditional values and morals. Something that from my experience dating in Australia at least was very very few and far between. Now, call me old fashioned and perhaps I was simply born too late and need to catch up with the times. But when I see footage of times gone by where men used to carry themselves like sophisticated gentlemen and women used to pride themselves on being elegant and ladylike, it makes me yearn for a more traditional world, especially when I look around me and see some of the utter degeneracy that is pushed by our modern day pop culture. Beat it up N word, catch a charge. Extra large and extra hard. Put this P word right in your face. Swipe your nose like a credit card. Hop on top, I wanna ride. I do a kegel while it's inside. Spit in my mouth, look in my eyes. This P word is wet, come take a dive. So seeing as though I'm traveling the world and creating content in different cities, I thought I would take the opportunity to find out, starting with the ladies of Taiwan, if there are any places in the world that have really held on to such values. And if the grass is really greener on the other side. So I hope you enjoy this. And at the end of this video, I will give you my honest thoughts. Let's get into it. Hey guys, quick announcement. This is gonna be the only video of this sort where we interview the girls that's gonna be released on this channel. Otherwise, we're gonna be releasing it all on my new channel, Rattlesnake Travel, where we're gonna be doing this plus much more from our travels around the world. So if you guys enjoy this sort of content, then hit the link, it's gonna be in the bio and pinned at the top of the comments, and you'll be able to go and subscribe to Rattlesnake Travel. Hope to see you there. Okay, so what's your name? Caddy. So Caddy. Alice. Alice. Uh, call me Debbie. Debbie. Yeah. Khalil. Debbie and Khalil. Yes. Fantastic. Uh, Annie. My name is Ang Ang. Ang Ang. Mm -hmm. Am I saying that okay, Ang Ang? Okay. <laughs> yes, okay, cool. <laughs> So Annie, today we're asking Taiwanese women about relationships and dating and that sort of thing. So first question I have for you is what do you look for in a man? To be honest, face. What kind of face? Uh, of course the face I think it's handsome. The face I think handsome. Mm. Yeah, and secondly, I think personality need to be fun. What's your idea of fun? Fun like, um, who can? Chandler. <laughs> Chandler. Do you know Chandler? Gentle. Chant Chandler. So Chandler. Oh, Chandler from Friends. Yeah, from Friends. Sometimes I wish I was a lesbian. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? A little bit, little bit dumb, a little bit weird. Yes, just quirky. Yes. Softball, sweet guy. <laughs> Soft and sweet? Yeah. And some sense of humor. Mm. Uh huh. And maybe tall. <laughs> yeah. Tall is a good personality. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. More independent, mm. like um, economic wise and emotion wise. Um, if talking to marriage, we don't want to live with our parents in law. That's a big issue in Taiwan. Mm. Yeah. So you think that you don't want a man who wants to bring his mum to live in the house? No, to totally not. And you don't want a man who lives at his mum's house? No. Well, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's understandable. It's a big issue. And body type doesn't matter as much? Yeah, that doesn't matter. Cool. And then in terms of personality, in terms of like, you know... You need to be high. La, la, da, 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 da. La, da, da, da. So, so nice face and tall. That's what you like. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then in terms of other attributes, like what kind of things do you look for in financial security or personality? We m need to make the same amount of money. Mm. So there's no inequality in our relationship. Right. Yes. Would you look for a man who earns more than you though? Is that attractive if a man earns more than you? Not for now. Stop really? Probably when I'm 30. Mm. Guys, if you enjoy this content, make sure to leave me a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and also leave me a comment about which city you would like to see me go to and do this kind of video. Back to the clips. Oh, happy with me. Like dancing, singing. Yes. 
this. <laughs> Can you sing me a song? Wow, amazing! Wow! <laughs> Do you want me to sing you a song now? Fly me to the moon Let me play among the stars Let me see what spring is like on <laughs> Most of Taiwanese people like the Korean style. You like the sort of like cute puppy dog? No, one? I like your face. <laughs> Thank you, I like your face. <laughs> so you like um, the more sort of rugged, handsome? Yeah. <laughs> uh, positive. Uh, pass pass so joking? Uh, positive. Hustle. Now, do it again. Uh, let me think. That's okay. <laughs> Finally, inner peace. <laughs> so soft, sweet, and tall. Mm -hmm. And any other things that you would look for in terms of physical looks or anything like maybe having money or muscles or anything like that? Mm, not really. Not really? <laughs> Just a feeling. Good. Yeah. So not more yeah. of like a sweet guy uh -huh. who's tall. So yeah. like a big, big gentle giant. <laughs> yeah. Does a woman need a man? I don't in think. In life? I don't think no? it's necessary. You don't think we're necessary? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, we need each other. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> and what what do you appreciate about men? What do men bring to your life that uh, that you that you don't have otherwise? I think everything. <laughs> yeah. yeah, they are stronger and like as a good helper. <laughs> yeah, we are good helpers. That's for sure. Taking care, like if I have like really low emotion part, I feel like he can be my support and I think that really helped me yeah there's nothing that you can think of that a man brings to your life that you think I can't live without that um, no. very similar to uh, Australian and American girls you be ready for the AF she ain't ready for the AF he be riding on the wave I ain't got a lot to say mine's heavy give me space Time's ready, let me blaze. Spend money, what a waste. Uh, time's money, money pays. <laughs> she ain't ready for the AF. Mad as I've been back and I'm back and it happening, ready to blow. I really like me, we leave you from the street, they left me on my own. Monkey asked me oh. about how I got the P, I told her leaving mama grow. Then they're ringing off my phone. Then they're ringing off my phone. Time's changed, but mine's made. Though. I ain't got line patience, try then, though, light bait. Just come close, but swear that. When goes to the hell, I never post loud, you better whack to my condo where I'm bare flat. Catch that for the gram, snap that for the man. Easy to the ball, no money in the hand. I ain't never had to feel away. Rhymes steady on the good away. Occupation make it either way. Never worry cause I can. Back chat from the white gang. Child in the sack, man. Passport been a milestone. I'm done, I'm done. And so what do you think that a man looks for in a woman? They will like sweetie. Cute like me. <laughs> I like cutie and I like you. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Cute, pretty, right? <laughs> and like probably also sweet, thoughtful. Cute, pretty, and sweet. That's my favorite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> very true, very true. I think tall, they will pe prefer. So you think that we want, prefer. we like. Tall women. Tall women. I don't. I, yes. I don't like tall women. I like you, small, cute. Why? <laughs> yes, not tall. Not like. Uh, so my tall is okay. Oh, perfect. Perfect. <laughs> perfect. I can do this more yeah. towards Oh. <laughs> it, it works out. But you think that um, Taiwanese men prefer women who more want to look after the home? Uh, yes, most of. And so, do you prefer Taiwanese men or do you prefer foreign men? I don't have preference. <laughs> if you had to choose one. If I had to. Foreign men. Taiwan. Taiwanese men? 
good. Stay loyal to the country. I think Taiwanese men. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And why is that? Mm, like, I think the culture is like more like similar, right? Easy to Easy communicate. To, yeah. And last question, and you have to answer this honestly, okay? Who do you think is cuter? Me <laughs> or my cameraman? One, two, three. <laughs> cut, cut, cut. <laughs> two, one, point. Ooh, oh, an even split, double day. Three, two, one, point. <laughs> Always happens. <laughs> Three, two, one, point. You. <laughs> Give me a hug. I go on. Yeah, okay, guys. So as we just saw, it's official. I'm the cuter one out of the two brothers. If there was a picture next to the word salt in the dictionary, it would have Vinny's current face next to that picture. But it's okay. I bullied him as a child and he's grown thick skin, so he can take it. So firstly, what I would say about the ladies of Taiwan is that they were extremely friendly and approachable, which was really nice and a breath of fresh air after some of the other countries that we've visited, which you will be seeing in the coming weeks. They were pretty happy to stop and have a chat. They had a great sense of humor and also speak really good English. So if you are a single guy and you find yourself in Taipei at some point and you can hold a conversation and you can make them laugh, you'll do pretty well for yourself. Now, in terms of those traditional values, I was actually quite surprised that Taiwan is actually a very woke country. Now, they're nowhere near as far gone as the West, but it's clear that as these countries start to become more liberal and start to adopt more Western ideas, they quickly begin to do away with tradition and progressivism becomes the new cool thing, as is the case in Taiwan. So it was interesting. It was probably about half half, but you can tell that there is certainly a rising tide of Yas Queen, boss babe, independent woman don't need no man on the horizon. So I hope you enjoyed that one guys and let me know what cities you would like to see me go to. We're gonna be traveling around Europe and probably even North America at some point. So leave that in the comments and stay tuned because in the coming weeks, there's gonna be lots more videos just like this. And if you guys enjoyed that video, click here to watch another one. Until next time, I'm Jake, this is Rattlesnake TV, keeping you armed and dangerous.